Now, I am Native American affiliated with the Red Cliff Band of Lake Superior Chippewa Indians and um, graduated from Bayfield High School. Um, so I attended a, a university for two years. I went to University of Minnesota Duluth and um, I, th I thought that's what I wanted to do. I thought that's where I had to go, you know. Um, I was a great student, top five in my class of a big whopping 27. <laughs> so, you know, big deal. <laughs> but, um, I, you know, so coming from a small town, I was like, okay, you know, I'm, I'm pretty outgoing. I could probably make it anywhere. Well, at UMD, I felt like a number. I, I didn't feel like a valued person, and um, it, it bothered me. You know, I, I tried to get to know my instructors, but it just didn't seem like they cared as much, you know, so it was like, struggle. And so, you know, at, at the end of that two years, I was like, what, what am I doing? And so I kind of took a step back and reevaluated my life and um, took some strength quest tests and decided I want to be a teacher. I, I decided to uh, visit WITC Superior campus. Uh, Cindy Miller is the admissions counselor at my campus and she was phenomenal. She's like, all right, we'll get you right in, let's go. I fell in love with my instructor, Lisa Brown, and um, every everybody was just so supportive. It was very hands-on, it was very like eye-opening. I was like, wow, th this is what I want to do. We're thrown into a class called practicum where they immediately put you into the field that you're working in. Everything that I've been learning is completely applicable. There there was nothing that was unnecessary that, that I was taking. Everything was meaningful and everybody was really supportive.